channel it's anena this is a special video because we'll be introducing a new series you don't have to buy it and joining me for this video is my lovely mother uh, thank you janita i'm so happy to join you in this video on how to make uh, anything in your kitchen so that you don't have to to buy it i'm happy to be here thank you so this is also a chance to bond with your family when you're in the kitchen making these recipes you get a chance maybe on a sunday afternoon to bond with your family talk to each yeah. other have fun yes yes before the hectic week begins yes that's it's true so... let out some steam <laughs> and, and play <laughs> and for for me it is basically to hand down some of my recipes yeah. and to to teach her what to do so that you don't have to buy everything from the market you can make it actually in your kitchen yes for this video we'll be doing sponge cake sponge cake is very easy and quick it needs a few ingredients however the thing with this cake is you need to follow all the directions and instructions carefully yes any mistake you make the cake will not turn out right. Yes. Yes. Hope you enjoy this video. Let's get started. The ingredients for this recipe will include... They are just very few and they are simple. So we have eggs, we have salt, we have vanilla extract, we have sugar, flour, uh, milk, and then oil. Those are all. Those are the only ingredients you need. You don't yes. have to need to get to get more than that. Yes, that's how you said it's a cake that needs a few ingredients. Yeah. We are starting with preheating our oven to 170 degrees Celsius. Next, we are going to line the baking pan with baking paper. This is me cutting the baking paper to match the size of the pan we are going to use. I then proceed to brush room temperature butter on the bottom of the pan as well as on the sides of the pan. I then dust the pan with flour to make the surface non-stick. So we are breaking, separating egg white from egg yolk from the four egg. Eh? egg yolks we are going to add a quarter teaspoon of salt one teaspoon of vanilla extract and then mix it all together this is the result when fully mixed the next step is to beat the egg white until for me we are then going to add one cup of sugar to the egg whites in three parts and beat until stiff
this is how your egg whites are supposed to look like after you've incorporated the sugar it's supposed to be stiff now add the egg yolk to the egg white and mix until fully incorporated Sift your flour by putting it through a sifter in order to break any lumps in the flour which means that our flour will be much lighter than unsifted flour making it easy to incorporate. And then start to mix from the bottom to the top. And you mix until it, the flour is fully incorporated and until you don't see any flour. To the milk which you had earlier measured, add 4 tablespoonful of vegetable oil and mix. Once the, it is fully incorporated, get some little cake butter, uh, mix the, the three together. Once they are fully incorporated, then uh, put combine them with the rest of the cake butter. We are then going to add the mixture to the cake pan and hit the pan from the bottom to get rid of any air bubbles and even out the cake. At this stage, put the cake butter into the oven to bake until ready. How do you know that the cake is ready? Get a toothpick, uh, push it in the middle of the cake. And when it comes out clean, then you'll know that your cake is ready. Then remove the cake from the oven, uh, put it in the wire rack to cool, ready to be served with either your cup of coffee or a cup of milk. Finally, we are decorating our cake with some icing sugar to make it look nice. We have come to the end of this video and we have a very lovely result. Ooh, let me see. Can you see? Thank you, mommy, for joining me on this video. Thank you, John, for organizing the whole video for us to be able to bake together this Sunday. A very nice. <laughs> we uh, started eating. <laughs> and we were now eating the cake. Very nice sponge cake. As I said earlier, I will put the whole recipe in the description below so you can follow step by step. And hit the thumbs up to show us that you have enjoyed this video. If you haven't already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. You can also check out my cupcake recipe video here. And I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. <laughs>